Hey there, movie fans. Welcome to the Hall of September 2023. Before I'm going to show you everything that I've purchased or uh, received over the month of September, I'm going to announce the next non-horror YouTuber of the month. Um, yeah, I, I was the non-horror YouTuber of the month September, so it's time for me to pass the crown. And uh, I did a, a video about a week ago where I nominated four great YouTubers. However, one of them, Ramon, the Dutch film buff, uh, has declined his nomination, which I absolutely respect. And it was up to you to you know vote for the next one. Uh, thank you everybody everybody for for voting. I absolutely appreciate it. And um, yeah, what, without further ado, I will announce uh, you know the next uh, king of of um, of the month or non horror YouTuber of the month. And that is. TV Nas. Steve, congratulations, buddy. You have received most of the votes. And you can call yourself now the non horror YouTuber of the month, October. Uh, you are now royalty, my friend. I hope you're happy with it. Just, just for a month, but still, you know. But, uh, yeah, big congratulations, buddy. Uh, you absolutely deserved it. And, um... You know, the, the other uh, YouTubers that I nominated... Uh, uh, Brian and Reddy and Paul from Grind Out Funhouse, they deserved it as well, and I, they deserved as much as Steve does, and I hope they will become the non horror YouTuber of the month someday, but now it's Steve Stern, um, yeah, Steve, I hope you're happy with it, and, and congratulations again. I'm looking forward to uh, the YouTubers that you are going to nominate uh, next month, so, yeah, enjoy it, and, um, yeah, Congratulations, I said that, sorry for repeating myself, but anyway, um, yeah, it, w it was nice to be king for a month. And now for my September pickups, uh, beginning with not one, not two, but three Hong Kong films with Xiao Yun Fat and Andy Lau. And uh, these are, you know, absolute solid films. Um, the one I enjoyed the most is, is Tragic Hero, was the second part of this, uh, you know, two-part crime drama. Yeah, the action is just over the top, and the kill count is, is insane. Yeah, very nice. God of the Gamblers. Um, if I had to... Uh, describe it in one sentence it would be rain man with blood and bullets <laughs> how about that but i really enjoyed this one yeah i enjoyed all three of them but um tragic hero was just insanely fun yeah next is land of the pharaohs by uh, howard hawks very happy this has gotten a blu-ray release I mean, this is a wonderful epic drama with uh, Joan Collins and Jack Hawkins and a, a personal favorite of Martin Scorsese um, it was a, a box office failure which disappointed Howard Hawks so much that he didn't direct another film for four five years something like that and after that he made a strong comeback with uh, Rio Bravo and speaking of Joan Collins she also stars in Magnum Cop, opposite uh, Mauricio Merli. Um, haven't seen it yet, but I heard that this is a minor Merli film. But it hasn't disappointed me yet, you know, so I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm going to enjoy this one. Yeah, and from Magnum Cop to Blazing Magnum. Uh, this is one of the um, better... Um, um, Italian uh, Dirty Harry knockoffs with a dash of giallo and a terrific car chase shot entirely in uh, in Canada and um, yeah I, I absolutely I absolutely enjoyed it very nice very nice next are these two fantastic box sets from uh, Imprint or Via Vision 
uh, two terrific films by Sam Peckinpah, uh, Bring Me the Head of Alfredo Garcia, uh, which I honestly I d didn't really need it because I have the movie twice on Blu-ray, you know, um, one is from uh, Twilight Time and the other is from um, uh, Arrow Video, but I love the movie and I love Pack and Paw, so for me it was a, a no-brainer. <laughs> And besides, this edition also has, oh here's, here's the, the Blu-ray of uh, Bring Me the Head of Alfredo Garcia, by the way. And the other one is the documentary Passion and Poetry, The Ballad of Sam Peckinpah, which again, I didn't really need it because I have, to move, I have this one on, on DVD from Germany. But, um, yeah, I'm, I'm a pack upon not so I, I, I just want to get this, you know, it's a wonderful addition. And I really like the, uh, the artwork on the, uh, on this uh, set. So, yeah, for me it was a no-brainer, absolutely no-brainer. And the next one is Cross of Iron. Um... Which I which I enjoyed, you know. This has the movie on 4K. Some interesting extra extras as well. And it also has the Grindhouse version, which I'm I'm actually more interested in that than the um, the 4K one, to be honest. You know, the Grindhouse version has these dirt and scratches on screen, you know. Um, you know, as it says here, it's, it's a, um, a new 2K scan of a vintage German 35mm theatrical print presenting an authentic 70s cinema experience. I like the sound of that. Yeah. I mean, uh, imprint is or, or via vision is becoming one of my favorite um, um, labels. You know, uh, I, I don't know if you've seen the um, their announcement for September. Oh, hang on, uh, which includes um, modern Brando box set, which looks pretty nice. But I'm I'm not sure if I'm going to get that one. But I am going to get the uh, Sydney Lumet box set. You know, I, I love Sidney Lumet, and um, um, that looks like a great box set. So I've pre-ordered a copy of that one. It uh, inc includes uh, Serpico, which I already have, but it's I I do it for, for the other films, which I haven't gotten yet. You know, The Offense with Sean Connery. That's one of his uh, best films. I hope that um, it is Volume One, of the Sidney Lumet box set, and. I hope that Volume 2 or Volume 3 will contain The Hill, which is another great uh, film that he made with Sean Connery. Anyway, last but not least, I got The Sensual World of Black Emmanuel. Oh, 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 oh. Oy, 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 oy. Severin, what have you done? They really went above and beyond with this box says look at this oy, oy, oy. And look it always has this you know fun thing here where you can you know change picture from picture I cannot show you the other pictures because they contain nudity and which is also the reason why I cannot show you the whole box set because you know, it's all nudity you know and you know YouTube right YouTube is very um, allergic to the female body and I don't want them to, to get sick so Unfortunately, I cannot show the whole box set, but um, what an amazing box set it is. Absolutely amazing. I mean, you got four, uh, uh, 15 discs, excuse me, 24 feature films, two soundtrack compilation CDs, 40 plus hours of special features, and a 356 page book. That is insane. Look at that. Look how thick this is. Yeah, and unfortunately I cannot show the, the, the pages because, again, nudity. 
but um, this is insane absolutely insane you know I, I was never really attracted to Sylvia Christel the original Emmanuel but Laura Gemser or Laura Gemser if you want me to say it in uh, in, uh, in English she is one beautiful lady absolutely a stunning woman but um, yeah this this is incredible absolutely incredible uh, one of definitely one of the best releases of the year if you ask me but yeah very happy with this very very happy with this and that is it for my uh, September update um, I hope you enjoyed it thank you very much for watching Steve TV Nash, congratulations again on um, becoming the uh, non-horror YouTuber of the month, October. And um, yeah, that is it. And I'll talk to you next time. Bye.